Hey guys, it's Kugli again with another ROM review and this time I've got KitKat Experience ROM V2 for Galaxy S3. So um, as the name suggests, this is kind of a uh, ROM which replicates the KitKat. Well, you can experience KitKat while the original ROM will come out eventually. So for those who are impatient enough to uh, actually go for the uh, ROM which only replicates it, this one is for you. So let's start, uh, here is the lock screen which is not the KitKat lock screen, it is the CyanogenMod 10. Okay, this one is based on CyanogenMod 10.2, uh, nightly 9.11, okay, that is 9th November nightly. So yeah, all those which uh, are associated with that are still here, okay. So um, let's get to the launcher first okay this one is the google home which is the latest launcher from kitkat okay so you can see kitkat features that is the icons are kitkat ish okay and you have the white uh, icons on the status bar so these are the kitkat features okay uh, the google now is updated so you just click here and uh, while well, i'm speaking now I don't know if it's recognized because I don't have data now, okay. Whatever, it does work, it uh, doesn't have all the problems with it, but I, I, I don't think the OK Google uh, listening always thing works, but yeah, uh, that would drain your battery faster than ever, okay. So about the launcher, you have all these features. It is available as a standalone launcher, but this ROM has that, uh, it comes with this, so yeah, uh, what's the problem? So uh, let's go to settings first. Okay, okay, that was the other setting. Let's go to settings. Okay, you can see all the theme. It, this is a themed ROM. Okay, so you have the theme here, which is this one. This is a KitKat theme. Uh, this is a normal uh, Jelly Bean theme if you uh, in any way want that. Now, so uh, here we are at the about phone page. Okay, you can see Sanogen mod things, updates, status mod statistic, statistics. Okay, this one is based on 4.3.1, that is Sanogen mod 10.2. Okay, so yeah, as I've said, it is on 9th November nightly. So uh, you get basic Sanogen mod stuff like the interface settings and uh, things like that. So yeah, it is still based on the Jelly Bean 4.3.1. So, uh, until you get Cyanogen Mode 11 support or uh, AOSP 4.4 ROM, uh, this can get you off, okay? If you are really impatient and you want to try out a KitKat theme, for me personally, this theme, like the white theme, is beyond measure. I really love it, okay? Uh, with the Jelly Bean, blue kind of uh, makes a, uh, what to say? It kind of gets old soon. This might get old soon, but uh, whenever I was in uh, Jelly Bean ROM, I always try to get a uh, white theme. I always used a third party th uh, third party theme like the Circle Light. So this one just makes it easier for me. I will just I don't need any other theme. Okay. So uh, rest of the ROM it's uh, similar to Sanjay Mod. Okay, you have the interface settings for all these. I'm not going to go into go deep into that. Theming feature, same I'm saying, okay. Lock screen again, uh, you have all these settings. Uh, it's kind of similar to any other uh, ROM, so yeah, pretty neat. Uh, let's see the other apps with which it comes, okay. It doesn't come with the uh, the call app, the phone app. It is still the Jelly, Jelly Bean phone app, so hard luck there. The, what, uh, the Hangouts is actually, um, uh, you can use SMS in this, so it's pretty neat. So let's see. Uh, I am sending an SMS. That's pretty neat, right? So that's something which is awesome in the new version of Hangouts. Uh, I don't know if everyone will like it or not, but I personally like it. Okay, so that's there. Uh, the developer says that the Gmail and everything, every app here is uh, updated to the latest version. Uh, Play Store is, of course, upla updated to the uh, latest this version with the sliding tab it is 4.4 so that's there uh, play music is also updated so everything is updated so yeah I guess that much is said uh, there's nothing much to show about this ROM it is uh, for uh, 4.3 so you guys know what all the features about it you won't be getting all the features of 4.4 because this is of course a themed ROM nothing more 
Uh, well, I guess that much is it about the ROM. Uh, nothing much or nothing superficial or extra. So yeah, I think that much is it about the ROM. Let me show you guys the boot animation. Here is the boot animation for uh, Nexus 5. Okay, this is Nexus 5 styled. It's really awesome. Uh, it is also available in the uh, Google Edition phones. It's similar to that, but it's quite quite playful. It's really nice. Okay. So yeah, I think that much is it about the ROM. Hope you guys like the video. Please share, subscribe and like the video if you really found it useful. So see you guys next time. Bye.